Jo. 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 Testing, jo. Good volume, jo. So we're gonna restring the Veeper. Restring the Reaper. Because the last time I played, I ended up breaking the B string. She'd be gone. Yeah, the camera's kind of funky. Because it's on 720p. It is what it is, though. Make sure everything works. Yep. Everything's working good. Everything's working good. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Gummy mm, bears. Yeah, so we're going to restring the bitch and then clean her up. Got to clean the fretboards, all the fret nails. Clean the pickups, the humbuckers, the humbuckers, humbucker. Humbucker. And maybe we'll react to some of the, uh, some of my collection of funny that I've collected on YouTube. Funnies, comedians, skits. React them a little bit. Like you don't just see me playing going, oh, stream doesn't want to go in. It doesn't want to go in. Stupid string, it's already broken. All right, so we're using what? Ernie Ball Hybrid Slinkies. So the nine, this is the one that broke. The 11, 16. 26 would be the D string, 36 would be the A string, and 46 would be the low E. Blue, 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 yep. Yep, 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 this is the uh, third time I'm restringing on stream. Because I keep breaking the damn strings. And it's always the E string, the, the high E or the, uh, the B string. But I don't like to keep the old strings. I mean, I can, but I don't want to clean the guitar. Get her nice and polished up. Get her all nice and clean. Get her all nice and clean. All right, so let's loosen her up. Loosen her up a little bit. Loose, 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 loose. Oh, loosen up the string. Because I'm going to cut them. What I actually. I won't cut them. I'll save them. Just in case. Because last time I broke the string, I didn't have any backups. So I couldn't play guitar for like a week. Did you find the death calls? Yeah, it's cute because it's an actual human skull. Shammy taking a shit. Take a shit, see him. Take a shit, see him. Take a shit, see him. Not yet. No, I think it just went in there. Sammy has poopophobia. He's got shitophobia. What a face. 
Here you go poop, Sammy. Go poopage. Go poop, poop. Maybe should turn on some music. There we go. Get to turn on the music. Are you sure it's not pooping? I think it's pooping. There's that piece of the B string. It broke. There's the low, the high. This is the G string. <laughs> G string. Do I look like Beavis? Yo, mama. <laughs> Give you the D string. D string. This is the A string. And we got the E, low E, low E. <laughs> Making sure we get the right height. And I put the new ones on. It's like a hand height, right? Oh, it looks like a little bit more than that. Maybe about right there. Looks pretty good right there. All right. Take the bridge off. Bridge, pull them off the back. There's the bridge. On the Deans, you can pull right out the back. This is why you usually cut them, so you don't end up scratching your bridge if it's painted or chromed or nickel plated. But I want to preserve these strings just in case. Yeah, because they're still clean. There's nothing wrong with the strings. They just, one of them broke. The broke. Some bitch broke. Soon be it's broke. Son of a bitch broke. Yeah, I'm so glad I'm taking the strings off because it is fucking filthy. Filthy. It is filthy. 
going right down the line. Be your own hitman. Use the piano wire. Piano wire. Piano wire. Put it down, down, put it down, down. Yeah. Here's the G string. Yeah, boy. Yeah, boy. It's amazing how sharp these damn wires are. And the last one, the high E. Number one string. Ooh, that some bitch is thin. That some bitch is thin. You can strangle a fucking flea. No, this string is no good. All right, it's already got bent in the center. Booty. This is doo doo. This is doo doo. Yeah, I can't reuse this string. Got a bend in the center. It's like a crease. John Crease. Yeah. All right, we got all the strings out. Get a general cleaning. Give her a nice wipe down. Yeah, I'm not going to use any chemicals or anything. No sprays or nothing. I don't want to, like, fucking get it all armor and then it's all greasy. I like to use... Where'd it go? Oh, there it is. Use a little soft brush. Just get in there. Just get in there. That works the best for me. I do hate the fingerprints, but like I said, I don't want to use any kind of chemicals. It'll make even more fingerprints. Now, to finish it off and get the fingerprints off, terry cloth. Terry cloth. Microfiber. Microfiber. I need to get this try a guitar tuned. Take it to a luthier. Get it tuned. I think the neck needs to be tuned. Since I went to a heavier string. Going with the hybrids. Because I think the low 8 when I got the guitar was a 7 or an 8. Get everything clean. No, a friend of mine who used to play for, uh, he was like a backup jazz guitarist. Said you can use uh, lighter fluid. That's what they used to use back in the 50s. Clean the fretboard. So it just gets a little stinky, but it works perfectly well. Perfectly well. But since I'm not a guitarist, I'm not a musician yet, though I want to be, to the best of my abilities, using Rocksmith, I'm not going to use the old pro tricks because I have no need for it. 
Because I think the uh, either the butyl or the benzene in the ladder fluid not only would it condition the fretboard, but it also cleans the strings. Nowadays, you got specialized chemicals. Whether they're bullshit or not, I have no idea. I'm a beginner. But it's usually bullshit in the case of specialized chemicals. Just a gimmick. If somebody that does it for a living tells me something and they're good at what they do, I usually listen. Now, I've adjusted the actions on my pickups because my strings were too high. The action was too high. Now that at the lowest point, it's still too high. My tight trick is now taking out the little nuts here. There. Finger. The little nuts. To make it lower, but apparently a part of the, the stem. This should come up, but it's... I think one of them is bent already. Which is a good time because that means I'm getting use out of the damn guitar. Because it, this, the bridge would usually come right up. Yeah, I'm not going to fuck with it. Yeah, I have it down to... I have it floored. Clean the bridge. Yeah, see if you pull the strings out, you get little nicks and stuff, but I really don't care. That adds character. Like little scars. This was brand new last year. Even though I had it for 16 years, I never used it. It was always... In storage in a case. But I decided I need to learn how to play guitar. Make sure that's clean. It's right in there. All right. Let's start with the biggie string. Big, 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 big string. Should be the 46. 46. 46. Well, let's play some comedies. Let's see what we got here. Well, I do the strings. Of course, you're not going to find any threats. Dumb shit. Dumb shit. Ah, music. Oh, let me stop right there. Ooh, get the last wipe down. The last wipe. The last wipe. Wipe your ass. Wipe your ass. All right. Here we go. Let's see. Who's first on the list? B. Dylan Hollis. Oh, this guy's hilarious. He makes depression food. <laughs> well, you'll see him. He's making a potato candy from the Great Depression. Goddamn. It's harsh. I think he just got married, too. The fuck is he making paper mache? Eight fucking pound, eight cups of sugar. That's fucking diabetes in a bowl. <laughs> Jeebus. God, that looks actually that looks pretty damn good. It looks like a sweet roll. Who's next? Should be still him. Man. War cake. Well, it's a TikTok vintage recipe.
<laughs> Y'all know how to make diesel? I know how to make diesel. <laughs> well shit that's what the soldiers are eating they're eating their own goddamn boots bless you why are you sneezing why are you sneezing alright there's a low E low E Put that to the side. Next. He's making 1895 eggnog. Ooh, that sounds good. Eggies. Get the eggies. <laughs> His fucking hair looks like a quarter pipe. You don't have to add any heat to me to get any thickness. Here's the D string. Now, if you thought this was going to be an instructional video on how to restring your guitar, you're sadly mistaken. But I want some of that eggnog. Give me that eggnog. I want some of that eggnog. See, I, I got to look that recipe. It looks pretty damn good. What do we got? Christmas crack from the 1970s. <laughs> Does it have to be raw sugar? <laughs> he sounds like the Jetsons. Hey, Puppas. Come in to investigate? That looks like uh, chocolate brittle. Hey, Papa. Hell yeah. Want some of that crack? Give me some of that crack. Water pie. The fuck is water pie? We're about to figure out and find out. <laughs> Hey, Bubbas. <laughs> That's rude. Hey, Bubbas. Jesus Christ, he's fucking savage. <laughs> How the fuck would he know what soggy lint tastes like? He's like, I gotta refine my palate. I'm gonna eat some soggy lint. Hey, Puppas, what are you doing? You playing? You trying to play guitar down here? You wanna play guitar? Here's the high. Last time I almost broke it and soling it. Hi, Baba. What you doing? 
What you doing? These are uh, demons at my feet. He's at my feet. He's at my feet. He's at my feet. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh, he's about to do his zoomies. Come on. Come on. Come on. You can do it. Demon. Come on. Hey. Where are you going? He wants to, but then he gives up. He's like, ah, not easy enough. Not easy enough. Come on. Yeah. Enough of that water pie. Oh, the kid is. He's a fucking furry Fritz cartographer. Uh, it's a cat. It's a given. It's a given that it's going to be spoiled. Service. Back to the table. What you doing, Bubbers? Now, what I learned the, for the first time I strung this. I forgot what they call it, but you're, you can loop it over itself. And it'll cause it to tighten up. Well, like I said, about a fist, finger length, right? Here, let's tighten it up a bit more. Probably can't see it. What you doing? I see your little hand. I see your little hand. I see you. The thing is, is that his cat toys have guitar strings. So he thinks it's a new cat toy. Hey, you want to play with this one? You want to play with, you want to play with Rocky? You want to play with Ricky Cotto Avocado? This is Ricky Cotto Avocado. Yeah, he's just sitting by my feet. Yeah, what you want, you want to make sure you get about at least three wines on the, on the posts, on the tuning machine posts. So, that looks pretty good. Then bend it. Bend the fucker. Right at the post. Then what I do, put it over. Tighten it. Make sure you're going the right direction. I think on the left side. What's that? Why am I hearing noises? You go over the top first. Over the top. See, you probably can't see it. But it's overlapping right now. Then the second one is going to go underneath the the reserve. What's sticking out? I will set up another camera, but the stupid program's not working. So on this one, it's counterclockwise on the left-hand side. We tighten it up. And no, I'm not going to buy one of those little guns to make it easier. You need finger strength. It's a good way to get finger strength. Now, once you start going over, you, yeah, you probably can't see it. But once it starts coming to the excess, blah, 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 go underneath it. So it's it's going to look like this. This is the ex the thumb, the portion of the thumb sticking out of the axis. Yeah, yeah, the axis. So it's going to look like this. Where the knuckles are the the windings. Yep. 
the all right on to the next one my kids my kids one of my kids damien doesn't know how to eat everything has to be chopped up for him shit i wish they ate like that someone's got a spoon feed them there you go we got two windings down two wind Ricky, cut avocado. Where are you going? Starting to tighten up now. And two and a half windings. And now it's developing the third. See, it's already starting to get, starting to get tight. The other thing I forgot to mention is you might want to clean the nut, which is the plastic piece up here where the string goes into the groove. They got tools where you can actually shape the nut to the proper string size, which I don't have. But each groove is a different size. Make sure there's no debris in there, no caca. Make sure there's no doo doo in there. Use a proper string size and try to clean it out. See, like this one's got caca in it. The uh, high E. String number one has got doo doo in it. Now, sometimes they do shift, but they should be glued in there. But sometimes they, they get kind of dookie. Do I have a knife in here? It looks like a, a little groove got wonky. Yeah, just reach in there. Yeah, sometimes if the string doesn't sit in correctly, it'll wear out the nut e unevenly. That's what I'm finding out here. But like I said, it's only plastic. And it should be loose, too. You might be able to take yours out. Like I said, this is not an instructional video. You just watch me do this. Acting like a damn fool. Might need something a little bit harder. Got some tweezers here. Let's see. There we go. Get the doo doo out. Get that doo-doo up. There we go. Got you, sucker. That's fairly hard plastic, so. It'll take a lot more than just hitting it to cause any damage. That's a lot of damage. All right, keep tightening my low E. There we go. Now we got three proper loops. Yeah. Now make sure it's on the bridge, too. You don't want to tighten it up and then it's not on the bridge. Okay, it looks like the finger length, from knuckle to finger length, the middle finger, was just right. Just right length. There we go. Don't want to tighten it too much. But now we, we got to stretch it once we have all the strings on there. All right. A string. Make sure the post 
I like to face my post this way, the holes. You know, perpendicular to the neck or to the uh, the stock head or the headstock, whatever you call it. So the holes go perpendicular to the fretboard. And we can go in this way, like this. Remember, you want the strings on the inside of the post. That's why I'm stringing them this way. And it's going to be the opposite on the right hand side. Ricky, go, son of a bitch. That looks pretty good. That looks pretty good. Bend it right there. Bend it right there. Oh no, Ricky. Ricky Cotto. Where you going, sucker? Next video. Oh, incredible things caught on camera. This dude. This shit is creepy. You see what it just happened? You see what just happened? Look, look at this. Watch this again. This looks like it's a camera on a ledge, right? See, look, he walks underneath. All right, all right, all right. And then he goes, he goes. Then he steps over. What the fuck? That's a good camera work. That's some good camera work. Creepy ass camera work. Remember, over first, then under. Let's go counterclockwise, counterclockwise. And go on. Oh. So I didn't want. Where I bent it, it just popped in because the string is not as thick. I'll back it out a little bit. Go back in. There you go. You can hold both of them by pressing on the loop in the center of it. Counterclockwise. Counterclockwise. Oh, I come across these people recently. They're by far my new favorites right now. Critical role moments. Don't know exactly what they're doing, but I think they're playing D&D &D or something. Which I don't play. But I like their comedy. <laughs> I guess he's coming in the back door, huh? Can you play that again? <laughs> okay. What the fuck? How did you get on? Oh. Not early. I went over. What are you doing? Oh my god.
There we go. Remember, film. Same people. Critical role moment. Oh, shit. <laughs> Fuck. Shit, that one rivals some of mine. God damn. <laughs> Fuck. That was a damn good burp. Ooh. That tuning machine is starting. That's the one I've been having issues with. It sounds kind of crunchy. Dirty, it might have a broken gear in it. Now remember, don't tighten it yet. Shiver and queef. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck was that? She fucking made a creep sound. Uh, this one by far is my favorite. <laughs> the snorting. Holy <laughs> they all fucking lost your shit. It was just thrown out there so quick. Oh, no. Here we go with Bobby Lee. No, not Bobby Lee. Not Bobby Lee. Ha <laughs> ha. 
<laughs> oh shit! Oh, that's brutally molested. <laughs> I guess he can't run from Down syndrome kids. Well, once they get a hold of you, they got that strength. They got that strength. We all know what kind of strength that is. Lanny had it. Pons had it. Chucky had it. Chucky damn near flipped the car over. How Bobby Lee lost his virginity. <laughs> Got the back cave going on. Why aren't there many Koreans at Down Zero? <laughs> Moving right along. Bobby Lee's bedtime stories. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, we gotta see that one again.
<laughs> it's a good tactic. Dude, if I had to buy a kid like Bobby Lee, I'd do the same thing. Theo Vaughn and Bobby Lee, oh no. <laughs> He's got fucking Is that Matthew Landis or something like that on his fucking shirt from uh the form of the prairie or what was it called? The little house in the prairie. Michael Landon. As the strings get thinner, it's harder to roll up. Yeah. Black people don't differentiate between indoors and outdoors. It's Theo Vaughn. <laughs> Fucking guys. Fucking guys. Theo Vaughn asked Bobby Lee funny questions. When is it not funny with Bobby Lee? Let's see here. <laughs> His fucking deadpan face. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Oh. <laughs> 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 
party. Oh. That's probably why the B string broke. You don't wind it up correctly, it gets a little bent. A little bent, bent out of shape. Last string. Hit that E string. String. Careful not to bend the string when you're holding it. Try to use all your fingers. Don't use just a few because then you'll put a crease in it. So try to look like that. You probably can't see it, but. Use your fingers, don't don't bend it or put a loop in it. Remember, let it fall in the nut. In the groove of the nut. Everybody like the nut. Go. There we go. Three windings at least. Make sure it's on the bridge too. All right, now that we got all those strings on there, make sure they're on the nut, make sure they're on the bridge. Now we can tune it. Tune it the first time. We're going to tune it the first time, then we're going to stretch them, and then tune it for the final time. Put it on the neck. Put it on the neck. All right, let me turn it around. I can see it better. Uh, I don't think you can. Go this way. Oh. 
What's going on here? There we go. Uh oh. Am I running out of batteries? Oh no, there it goes. Okay, there's the E already. Let's turn that off. Turn it off. Okay, there's that E. That on the money. Should be A. And as you tighten them, they're going to get out of tune. But that's just the nature of the beast. D. There's C sharp. And there's D. Letter D. Letter D. Now G. I oh, can't see it. There you go. There's G. Can I see it? I want to see it. All right, there's G. Now B. A sharp B. Okay, there's B. And then just regular E. High E. I loosen the real quick. Okay, there's E A C D D sharp and E. No, high E and low E are one octave apart. That's what differentiates them. Now, once you tighten up the top three, you got to tighten up the low three again. And it's not by much.
AD. What? G. No, the first time around doesn't have to be precise. Cause remember, we're gonna loosen them up. We gotta stretch them. All right, now we can stretch. All you gotta do is just pull them a little bit. Don't get all crazy. Pull them a little. Make sure they're nice and tight. This is a stretch of string. Yeah. No music on. Okay, now we tune it again. Tune it. See how it changed? There we go. A string. D string. G string. B string. E string. There we go. Recheck them. Right on the money. Right on the money. Forget to turn off your tuner. Ugh. No, I still can't play music yet. Let's see. Let's see how she feels. It's good to have a B string again. to find a better position what the? we need to have it over here there we go oh it's too far in you need to have it like up here Feels good. She's nice and clean. Oh, yeah. You know what? I don't like the B. It's 
It's got two and a half landings on the B. But it's already bent. I'm just gonna have to live with that. Yeah, all the other ones have three windings. Just the B, got a little shy. Cut him off. Cut him off. You don't want to poke someone's eye. Cut him off. Cut him off. Now don't cut your main string. There's one. Two. Three. You know, I'm going to leave the B string long. Just in case. Just. Ow, ow, ow. Stab myself. Stab myself. Ooh, like a syringe. There we go. Right in my finger. And all the other ones in in case you grab your guitar by the headstock. You don't want to get a stab. Stabby stab. Stabby stabby stab. So. a little under an hour just fucking around she's back to normal she's back to normal I don't know why this does not feel right does not, I don't like this position like I'm feel compact like my shoulders are too wide for this Position. I gotta have it up here. Sure sounds crisper. Yeah, she sounds a lot crisper. All right. So what I gotta do? Let's see. Yeah, I should restart the stream and then come back to Rocksmith. Let's play some Rocksmith. Yeah, that's what we can do. We can play some rock. Now, for some reason, that stream marker is not working. Something went wrong. Try it really that quick actually again get it later. Really? Sucker. Oh my god. You guys gotta watch this. What do we got?
<laughs> oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Look, I give him Nazi fucking like memorabilia. You give him Hitler's cup. Wow. <laughs> Who's this? Ralph Bar Ralph Barbosa. <laughs> sure feels a lot crisper. There we go. All right. Let's get some Rocksmith done. How am I going to do this? I have another scene for Rocksmith, but I haven't updated it yet. I need to update it. Yeah, see, that look booty. I like the new one. I like this sword. I just got to find a place to put the... Uh, Oh, well, maybe I can do that. Let's see. What was that? All right. Ball stream. Ball stream. Balls. Let's see. And can you get the game up there? Let's see. Wait, what happened? Let's see what happened. What we can do. That's actually a pretty good camera angle. I like that. the game going let's see where's game rocks milf I left the cord Got it. I got her. All right. I had her technical difficulties, but not so much.
Uh, uh. All right, let's get the game going. You. That's actually a pretty good camera angle for the fretboard. There we go. Was that too blurry? Put it on my shirt, maybe? There we go. That's a little. Put it at the center. Put my headphones on. Rocksmith. There it is. All right. All right. Let me stop the stream. I'm going to stop the stream and then restart it. Now come back with Rocksmith because they always mute the stream and then I can't put the VOD up. Alright, so I'll be right back.